Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another edition of Breaking News with your host, Prince Charles. Now, I'm going to speak differently on this. I'm going to be low monotone instead of high voice because right now I'm an emotional wreck. After that last event that I participated in when I beat Jay Stereo and let's say Dash Andrews. Now, I know a lot of you fans are like not liking how I won the match and how I cheated and all that. First of all, I never cheated. Secondly, I won the match. So you fans are going to have to deal with it. And you guys are going to have to get your pennies out in a bunch of how I won the matchup. Because winners win and losers lose. And what matters is that I'm now next in line for number one contendership. Ship. Excuse me. Number one contendership for the all-out World Heavyweight Ch Championship with my friend and I guess my idol, as like as like y'all like to call it, my hero, Craven Rage. Now let's talk about this Craven Rage. Craven, I know we're best friends and all. I looked up to you, especially all last year, when the fans kept booing you, fans kept hating on you. I was the one that kept cheering you when the fans didn't believe that you would be champion for a long time. I was the one that believed it. When fans didn't even think that you would break a milestone for this company, I was the one that believed in you. I was all, I was the one. If you think about it, if it wasn't for me being a cheerleader, you probably, you probably would have lost the title already. Because I'm kind of your lucky charm. Especially at the last event when you defeated Dash Andrews and JDT in two days straight. But right now, I'm not your lucky charm. Because I'm number one contender. In fact, when we step in the ring, I won't be your friend. Because this is a new... Prince Charles. This is a different Prince Charles. This isn't somebody that goes on commentary and kisses up to you every freaking day of my life. This isn't some Prince Charles that's going to look up into you and bow down to your toes, your feet, and kiss up to you. It's like that old saying, never meet your heroes in real life. Because one of them doesn't turn out the way you think or believe they are. And right now, I don't think you know how capable I am of doing some damage. I don't think you're capable. I don't think you know how capable I am of actually pulling off upsets. I wouldn't call them upsets, but according to the fans, they're upsets. Two in a row, I defeated Jay Stereo. That should be enough to get it through your head that I'm nothing to play with. I know you beat everybody, but I ain't like everybody. I'm the man on a mission. So right now, I hope you're studying on the two matches that I was in from last year and from the last event that I was in in the triple threat match. Because I ain't finna go easy on you. You ain't finna get somebody that kisses up to you. You're gonna get somebody that's lean, fit, and in shape. And you might see the new ruler of the yard. So you better get ready. You better study. You better work out. Because I know I am. So anyway, that's all the time for now that I have now for breaking news. I haven't broke any news, but I really don't need to break any news. Because the real news is that I'm the next in line for the contendership of the world title. And spoiler alert, you're going to see a new ruler of the yard. And people are going to have to deal with it. Craven Rage, you might have to deal with it. I know we're probably going to still be friends and all that in the future. To tell you the truth, I don't know what the future holds between us. But this is now. And right now, you're on my list. I'm not on your list. So be ready. Prince Charles, out.